All right, well, it's the morning of day 18 now, and we had a wandering horde kind of wander by last night, but they didn't really bother us. Had a bunch of stuff going here. We're making a ton of concrete. Well, not a ton, but enough. Um, I couldn't make any gas last night. I thought I had enough to make a stack. I mean, I could have, but I thought I had made, got enough to make a stack, but uh, we were short by 700, so... I didn't bother making any gas. I'm gonna have to go hit up some oil shale for sure today. The other thing we need to hit up is iron. Uh, we're running really low on iron and I need it for um, uh, steel. So it's one of the things we're gonna need to do today uh, as we've only got 14 steel. Now in here, uh, we've got a, a ton of concrete so we're okay with concrete. I made a bunch of uh, rebar frame blocks last night. We had 62, I made 300 more. Should be more than enough to get started on the base. Um, and I think we had the flagstone blocks in here too. I'll probably use these for around the outside on the ground of the base for now until we can get it updated. And we'll go ahead and update that. So we, in here, I'm just waiting for the uh, fire axe to finish. It's a level four fire axe, steel fire axe. I was able to make that last night. Um, the level five wrench was better than the level three one that we had or level four one. So I'm definitely gonna keep that. Pulled the mods off it and dropped it on the steel pack, pickaxe because this thing with no mods was the same as our other wrench. So that's perfect. I made a thousand rounds of 762 last night. They're still going. So I'm gonna take two stacks with me today. Now we're gonna pull, uh, where is the, we got some stuff in here to sell. Now I didn't have any mods in the fire axe, which is fine. So we're gonna need wood today as well. So let's bring that down. I'm not expecting to, to run into any problems today as we're outside. So we do have some other stuff we can sell here to the trader, but I'm not gonna worry about that until day 19, which is tomorrow when they restock. Uh, we've got a few other things. Oh, we can take the weighted head mod out and put that on the fire axe, I think. So let's go ahead and do that. We have got one here already. We don't need it on the shovel. Now I put uh, this on the, the Grave Digger mod onto the pickaxe only because the shovel is one-shotting everything now. So there's no point in putting any extra mods on that. So I put it on here so for hitting sand, um, we can hopefully do we can hopefully one-shot it with a pickaxe as well. But I'm going to go ahead and put the... Uh, this guy on here, hopefully knock it down, knock down trees a little quicker. So let's go down to the motorbike and head over to the desert so we can get that oil shell that we need. Hopefully we can find some iron over there, get that knocked out, and then we'll come back and work on the base. I guess first things first, we got some wanderers. What's up, lady? Ooh, see ya. Now we got Mo over here. Let's take care of him. Mo. Well, I'm right here, buddy. Sup, yo? Survived that one, did you? Sounds like we got respawns in there. I ain't going in to find out. Either that or somebody wandered in there, which is possible. Uh, there's Big Mama. Who do we got out here? Big Mama, Mo, some other dude. Mama. Aim for the face. Aim for the face. Whoa. Ow. Okay, cool. Those guys are done. Let's go get in the bike and we're going to head out to the desert. Alright, so we're here now. We're going to hit up this spot. It's like right by the edge of the desert. So we're going to hit up these uh, three sh uh, oil shell... Um, plots right here and hopefully we can pick up a bunch of oil shell in a relatively quick time. Alright, so we got over a stack of oil shell here and let's see what we got here. Yeah, over a stack and we needed like another 70 to make a whole stack of uh, fuel from back home so I got a little bit of extra just to be able to make some more. Now let's get out of here uh, we need, still need iron, but I want to hit up a POI first. Actually, here's a little bit of iron right here. Let's just grab some of this on the way. Okay, so I've never been in this passing gas before. Now, we've looted the, the uh, fuel tanks here a little while back. But we're going to go ahead and go in here. I just want to see what's in here. See what we can get out of this place. Wake up. Nobody.
Is that person outside? Pretty quiet in here. They gotta be outside. That looks like the back door there. Headlight, take that. Oh, that's kind of nice. Even though we don't need them. Well, looks pretty quiet to me. Locked door, huh? Still quiet. Yeah, some of these POIs are strange because they go in them and there's like nothing in them. Like no zombies. Anybody here? Come on, wake up. Nobody in the toilet. Nothing. Alright, let's break these open. Well, oh, somebody outside heard us. Just a lot of boxes or stuff? Really? That's all that's in here, huh? Take those, some sellable stuff. Okay. Just sell that string, I think. I don't know why these bookshelves are backwards. Blade trap mod we've already got. Machine gunner. Automatic weapons do 10% more damage. Yes, please. Sure. Might as well grab it all. We're here. Fancy toilet. Okay, this we can scrap. Uh, let's hang on to those. Where's my wrench? We need springs. Every spring is one grenade. Oh, they made their way in. I'm up here. Dude. You coming up? They're not even inside for crying out loud. What the hell? You had me all excited there for nothing. Okay, I'm not using those. We'll take the paper for shotgun rounds. Fancy toilet. Take that. Meh. Let's get this brass. Any brass is good brass, that's what I say. Uh, let's just drink this. Alright, we gotta, still gotta do the roof here. Doesn't sound like anybody up there. Pretty darn quiet. Well, there you go. Another POI if you guys are playing with this uh, mod pack. Another POI free of zombies. Not exactly sure why that is. Yeah, we want to take that. We really need a padded hood? Probably not. Uh, I don't need the bird's nest. That's leather. We've got three anvils already, so we can go ahead and scrap this one. We'll get another one here. Scrap both of those. That's worth 42. Yes, yes. We can scrap this. Bring that down. I mean, I, I know I could go down. Oh. I know I could go down to the bike. Drop this stuff off and come back up, but I only want to make one trip here. Oh, great. Guess we're making more than one trip, huh? We don't need that. We don't need that. Let's grab these two. Um, might as well just scrap that. We can make them in the forge. We can make these in the forge. 
see what we got in here. I wonder if that zombie is going to make its way up here before I finish looting this. Okay, military helmet, shotgun. I want the helmet. Oh, I want to scrap it though. Uh, what can we do here? We need the light. We don't need the light, I don't think. I want this. To, I want the parts for this. Although we could just scrap. Uh, what? I got too many things scrapping. Wow. I do have too many things scrapping. Uh, that's for the military parts. Those are all iron. Uh, that's fine. Let's go. Actually, you should probably check these out before we go. That's worth it. That's definitely worth it. And that's definitely worth it. All right, good thing we checked those. Now, can we get down this way? Sure can. Doing things the Minecraft way. Uh, all right, let's just head back to the house. Take this stuff in and then get working on the base. Okay, there's still somebody. He must have wandered in here. Not in there anymore. All right, let's take this stuff upstairs. I'm gonna grab all the material, come down, and start working on this base. Now, I didn't leave anything in here, did I? No. Okay, looks like we can make eight stacks of gas. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. That's what, 63, it was what, we need 64 minutes? 63, 20, 64, 10, beautiful. We're definitely gonna use that gas for sure. Now, we do have some cans in here we can make oil out of, but I'm gonna leave that for now. Don't need this on us. Uh, that can go in here. We got all that. We need to have the hammer. Don't have any fuel for the auger just yet. We need this and this. I think that's all we need right now. All the concrete. Oh yeah, the iron needs to go into here. Actually, that's like, what, 10, 11? Okay, uh, and yeah, so we'll bring this down. We're gonna need the shovel out, the pickaxe, maybe the axe. Why do I have... Did I forget to... I totally forgot to do that. Let's just go ahead and scrap this guy. What was I thinking? Beautiful, okay. We can put these parts in here. All right, let's go downstairs. Okay, so last night I worked a little bit on this. And as you can see the door there, I took out the, the concrete and I put in bars because I want to be able to see down from up there just in case I need to shoot somebody below. Now I'm going to put I'm gonna upgrade those to uh, forged steel. And then on the inside, I brought the, knocked the wall out, brought the staircase down. There's going to be a platform here. It'll come down a little bit this way and then probably out. But we'll see how it goes. I don't know how far down we can get. We might go zigzaggy a bit. Uh, zig down to here to a platform to zag back down and then over I don't know we'll see but we're gonna leave that for now all right so uh, let's go ahead and dig up the corners like this ah the steel shovels like one shotting everything now it's beautiful can't wait to get that auger working though okay so there's the corners I'm go ahead and pick all these up all right now we're just gonna dig this out Okay, so that's the platform base. Let's just do that. Uh, yes, and then these guys can come down. So put these guys in everywhere but the exact center. Okay, so that's all rebar. So let's just bang these in. Okay, so there's the floor. Now we're going to go one more. Now we could upgrade that floor to steel, but we don't have anywhere near enough steel. So we're going to just leave it as reinforced for now. But this is really the main floor right here. Because this is the only place that the zombies can bang on. So let's go ahead and upgrade this to uh, reinforced. All right, now there's that. Now that's the floor. Or ground level so let's go around the outside I just want to lay the flagstone down now just where it's gonna be at least maybe like three wide here all 
Okay, let's drop the first level in just to see here. Now, I want to make it so that at least this is reinforced down here somewhat um, because I want to be dropping Molotovs and grenades down if, there, if there's um, zombies on the outside. Like, you know, Molotovs, grenades, pipe bombs. So at least it has to have some kind of resistance. Also, if cop blows up down here, we want it to not destroy the ground, which will give them more of an opportunity to get underneath the base. I know this is not really that strong right now, but we're going to upgrade it to um, to uh, brick right after this. So let's just go ahead and make this a little wider. Okay, so there's the second row. We're going to go ahead and drop these guys in. And I'll probably just upgrade these first two rows, see where we are with the uh, cobblestone that we've got. And then we'll probably put a third one in. I don't know if we'll need three for this next horde. Like I said, it's only like, what, it'll be like the day 21 horde. It could come on day 20. But it might be 21. We've kind of gotten lucky the last two times. It's been on day 7. Rather than day 6. So let's go ahead and upgrade these. Alright, there's that. Man, we really need to get a nail gun. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and do the next layer. we got lots of concrete left, so let's go ahead and do this layer. Hopefully zombies won't make their way in here, fall into the hole in the center, and then try and dig their way out and break some blocks before Horde Night. Alright, we're going to upgrade this row. Okay, so there's that. Now we need to work on the ramp. So, um, I want to use stairs. Let's just make like 20 stairs for now. That's going to put it up five blocks high, which I think is probably good. I don't want to go too high. So let's take out these three. One, two, three. We're going to do this as we go. Okay. These four. Now these need to be full solid. It's not until we go up one level that we'll put this one on an angle here. Okay, now we've got to figure out, so we want to be shooting at them, like, probably from here over. So this could be the top of the stairs right here. Four. So, first one up, second, third one up, fourth one up, fifth one up, and then we're up on the top right here. Right? So we need to take out one more of these, actually two more, because I want this to be reinforced at the bottom as well. So like that. Okay, and then we do, take this out for now. So this would be one, two, right? Get these knocked in. Okay, and then we go we go three, four. I really hope a uh, demolisher doesn't blow up on top here. Okay, and then we go like this. Right, next one. And then the last one we go, or is there one more after this? One more after this, right? We got one, two, three, yep. Yeah. One more after this one. So that one, and then one more. Probably gonna have to go hit up some more wood here in a second too, because damn, that's one thing I haven't gotten today yet, it's wood. Okay, let's go ahead and upgrade these now. Okay, now we want to go ahead and let's get our shovel back down because we don't need the stairs anymore. 
Let's get our shovel down. We want to do a little bit of a angle here on the corner to make it easier for the zombies to get back up again. So one, two, three. Going to use reinforce down here. And then the rest will be flagstone over there as well, same as here. Then we're just going to put... Actually, will these guys... Can we do that with these guys? Uh, we can't. Um, I'll worry about that afterwards. I think i got to go and make that in the... I'll, I'll make them in the mixer. So let's bring these guys down. We're going to go ahead and fill around the outside of this with the flagstone. All right, well, for now, that'll do. Let's drop these in. We're going to have to expand this a little more, but for now, it will hold. So we'll put the flagstone all the way around here. Okay, so that's all that done. Let's just grab this one piece right here. Okay, we're going to upgrade these. Now, how much do I have left here? Oh, we got lots. So we should be able to upgrade all of this. Okay, so that's that part down. Now I think we need to, I think we are going to fill this in. How much concrete do we have left? 95 blocks worth. So let's just get some of this in here. Okay, so let's go ahead and get our angle blocks now. Come on. Uh, shape. Angle. Uh, advanced. Where are you? Come on. Okay, angle blocks here. Okay, so that's nice and supported now. So when they come up here, right? La 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 la. Then they get funneled into here, banging on a door, being shot at from this side the whole time. This is going to go out and across. We'll probably need to put a support pillar up, but I don't know, maybe not, because we're five blocks up, right? Even if they're standing on each other's shoulders, they won't be able to hit this block below here. Like, they won't be, hit any, be able to hit any block here. Especially if we make these plates. We can go ahead and make these plates here. And that's the other thing too, um, later on, when we're on later hordes, we're going to put plates on, the, like we'll make all this reinforced, like our steel first, and then we'll go ahead and put plates on all this and make all that steel too. So we'll have basically four blocks of steel here. Well there, we'll have three blocks here, but four blocks of steel along here. That'll kind of be the goal. Alright, let's fix this back to uh, this. Now, how much concrete do we have left here? 50. Not a whole lot. Let's just put one on each corner. Alright, so we're going to have to go and do a crap ton of mining so that we can... We're, oh, that's right. These take 20 each. <gasps> right. That's right. Alright, so we're going to have to do a bunch of mining for stone. Uh, we're going to need trees for wood. So let's go ahead Go over there now and get some trees. And then I might just go down below. I'm gonna have to dig a hap you know what? There's a mine over here. We've got a, a we've got a um We need lead too, so we got a lead mine over here. Oh well, that's nice. I'll take that man. Over three hundred per hit. Burns through the stamina pretty quick, but getting that wood pretty damn quick too. All right, uh, what are we at? 726, not a whole lot. Let's get these guys planted, rip this guy up. Let's get these cl away from our house here. Makes it easier to see Zambonis out here. And take this guy down.
what are we at now? Over a thousand. We should be okay for tonight. Ooh, nothing. All right, now where is our? Should just be right here. The mom, we got jumped in. Here it is. There it is. All right, now we can pick up some stone, sand, and the ever important lead. All right, so we grabbed a whole bunch of stuff out of there. Uh, at least two stacks of stone, over a stack of iron, and almost a full stack of lead. So that's perfect. We're going to head back. I'm going to get this stuff moving um, in the forges. And hopefully we'll be able to make uh, enough concrete over the next couple of days to be able to finish up that base. If not, we'll look for another POI to hit up and stay at. Uh, which shouldn't be so bad. I mean, we survived the last two Horde Nights and random POIs, I'm sure. If we go over to the other bank, um, that should have, we should have no problem holding, a, holding down the Horde Knight there. Just throw down a bunch of barbed wire in the bottom and just sit up on top there and wait for the Horde to come and wipe them out when they arrive. So we'll see how it goes. I'm hoping to have the base done, but we'll see. All right, let's get up here. Okay, let's get the cement going. Not a lot, but it's start. All right, let's get over here. This is done. Beautiful. We got that for next time. Put that in here. Put that and that. And in here, we can drop off this iron. Now, I don't want to do all of my iron. So normally that would take 60, but we've got this in here. So like 40, probably. 40 wood, roughly. That's a little too much, I think. Maybe 42 or something like that. That should be the perfect melt. Don't want to waste uh, stone. Now, uh, forged steel. How much can we get going here? 225. Let's make 200. Get that started. And we need to melt some more. Where are you here? Some more brands. We don't have a whole lot of brass to melt, but we'll melt this tonight. We'll melt that tonight. Uh, anything else? We don't have any. No, nope, melted already. The lead can go in. All right, so I'll melt that up tonight. Uh, we can leave this in here too. Got plenty of clay now. Um, melt all that. That's for the concrete tonight. This I'm going to turn this into junk turret ammo. Let's just go ahead and make it an inventory. Uh, that way we have got enough junk turret ammo, I think, for the Horde Knight. The junk turret's not going to play a major role, but it'll play enough of a role that we'll probably need it there. You know, you don't want to shirk off extra firepower. All right, get that moving. Um, all right, so I'm going to leave it here. And until next time, we'll see you later.